Hello, cultist. Devour has an update. Hooray! As I mentioned in my last update video for Devour, some of the core development team for Devour recently took a step back while dealing with health issues. Because of this, the new map we were hoping to get in September, the Slaughterhouse, was pushed back till next year. But as the spooky season starts to settle in and haunted houses, corn mazes, and pumpkins start popping up everywhere, Devour has plans for a small content patch to celebrate. I'm not sure exactly when this patch will drop, but it will certainly be soon, and as early as September 28th. It will include limited time achievements and items for players. But before we get into that, let's talk about pets. In Devour, players can earn several rope styles through achievements and by progressing through the game. In addition to these character skins, players can also purchase skins for their character and for the flashlight. If you're a fan of Nathan or April, both of these characters will be receiving new skins available for purchase. But in addition to this, all characters can now have pets. Obviously, these pets are tied to the maps The Farmhouse, The Asylum, The Inn, and the new map, yet to be released, The Slaughterhouse. The town doesn't appear to have its own pet style. I think an opportunity for a pet snake may have been missed here. Maybe we'll see something for it in a future update. In addition to these visual changes, there are some other minor quality of life changes made. Devour now has Discord integration, which allows players to see what map of difficulty you are playing. You can now mute players through text chat and those of you playing in VR will now be able to use a gamepad while in VR. There are other improvements to the in-game player list and clients can now start kick votes. Also, the pumpkins will be returning for the Halloween season. Interestingly, it appears that if you earned the pumpkin robe last year, that it has been removed from your inventory. And upon collecting the 10 pumpkins on the town map, you'll receive the achievement jacked and once again, have the robe. If you've not collected pumpkins in Devour before, then you'll have 40 pumpkins to gather, 10 in each map, and can follow my guide linked in the video description. In addition to the pumpkins, there will be a new free outfit for the cultist during Halloween, if you win a game playing as the cultist. There is currently no available image for the skin, so you'll have to earn it when the update comes out to see what it looks like. This may be a small update for Devour, but it's nice to see that some new stuff will come to the game as we wait for the release of the slaughterhouse. Did you gather all the pumpkins last Halloween? Will you be attempting to earn the new cultist skin? Do you like the pets coming with this release? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and remember, gaming should be fun. I think an opportunity for a pet steak. Oh my gosh.